The event was an opportunity for us to engage with the homeschool community in Northern Michigan and for those families who homeschool their kids to be able to come together and engage in activities where the kids learned about civics in Michigan. It was fun. It was, it was pretty fun. Um, I got to be a, like a speaker for the chief police. I learned a lot about the state government. Holly worked with the younger kids. They were aged, you know, anywhere from six to, to 10 years old and she led them through activities for them to, to learn about civics in Michigan. Mike Van Beek, he also uh, worked with the kids, the older kids, to teach them about civics. They focused on a bit more of a um, challenging issue, and that was how, or the process of whether or not a bill should become law. So they took on the role of legislators and were divided into groups and they were actually given a, an actual bill you know, type scenario and had to debate uh, whether or not that bill should become law. I think, I think it was a really nice opportunity to meet other families. Um, not all of them are close. <laughs> we're, like, we're, like, we're like three hours apart, some of us. But it is nice to see other families and you know, see all the different aged children and how well they can get along. Homeschooling doesn't make you an alien. They all sat together, they all listened and enjoyed each other's company and the teachers, they're respectful. It was really great having that opportunity to sit down with the parents and just really have a conversation about their experience as homeschoolers, as you know, teaching their kids in the comfort of, of their homes and teaching them in a manner that uh, works best for them. They were able to share some of their challenges and uh, we talked about different types of education policies that might benefit them or those that might actually uh, hinder their ability to teach their kids as they best see fit. This is actually amazing because first of all, the room was full, which was great. I saw everybody, there are all different um, age groups that we could accommodate for all this, but I really liked having something for the older kids because something that they could sink their teeth into that could really be a challenge for them in, as far as like, why are we part of this government? What are we doing? What do we have to be concerned about? I just want my driver's license. You know, it's not that. It is like how to be an actual citizen and care about things. It's really important that we have a solid understanding of the educational landscape in Michigan and the different types of educational options that are available and the parents are utilizing. You know, we are limited in the types of options that we can uh, make available to kids in Michigan. But to, to see these opportunities that homeschoolers are, that they are bringing to kids is really amazing. So we want to be aware of what these different uh, options are, what they look like, and also ways that we can support them uh, so that they can provide, you know, the best possible learning experience for their kids.